David, we're seeing a wave of installations of these Haas machines, this new five axis UMC 750. What's the reason that you purchased this machine and what do you like about it? Well, first of all, we liked, as you've just demonstrated, the ability to really open a door up and get straight in, straight into the work area, makes it much easier for operators. That's one of the things we like about it. Also, we have capacity, sheer size of workpiece in here, and also the 40 position tool changer. Because you've already got Haas machines in the machine shop, and you do have a Haas 5 axis, or you've got a VF2 SS with a two axis table on it. The differences for you between the UMC and that machine, so mainly the capacity, the, the access. Yeah, and the tool changer. That means that when we come to set up a job in here, we don't have to think about putting the tools. The tools are already in the changer. They're already positioned. We know that we can just call them up straight when we do the programming and we can get straight onto the workpiece and start making parts. Because they've got 40 tools on this machine and that, that, that extra 15 tools can make a big difference, can't it? It makes a huge difference. Because yours is full. <laughs> For ours is full, indeed it is, yes. Now, what are you machining on here? We've got an aluminium billet on here. Are you, are you, are you, are you tackling all kinds of different work? Yeah, we're doing a, a range of work on here. We're taking jobs where we're machining straight from the billet, and we're also finding that we're picking up work um, machining die castings and that type of product as well. So it, it gives us a great flexibility. How do you find 5-axis programming? To start with, yeah, for sure. It took a little bit of working out, and the difference here is we're using different axes as compared to a previous machine. But once you get used to it, yeah, it's fine, and we don't have any difficulty with it. And do you do a lot at the control, or do you do it offline? No, we do offline. Now, the machine itself here, we've got a 12,000 RPM spindle. We, it, it can come with, with lots of options. I, I note here that you've got probing on the machine. You've also got through spindle coolant. Are those options that you selected, or did they come standard on the machine? What happened during that purchase process? Well, the purchase process, this particular machine was offered to us with these options on. But it's not until you get the options and you use them and you go, oh yeah, we kind of really like having these options. To be honest, the through, um, through, coolant, through spindle coolant wouldn't have been something perhaps we chose. Now we've got it, we find we use it, you know, and that's kind of the, well, sometimes just how things go. But sure, the probing is a great thing to have. On that probing then, so you're, you're measuring your tools, making sure that your, your, your tool offsets are correct? Yeah, that's correct, yes. Another point is the access and the, the way the internals are laid out on this machine. The conveyor centrally removal of, of swarf, is that an efficient way of getting, getting rid of the metal? Yes, it's very efficient. Actually, what we find is the width of the conveyor, the speed at which it moves, and also the angles of the surfaces that deflect the swarf down. And actually, a lot of the swarf is just cleared out in process, so it works very well. And is this machine much faster than the VF2 SS? Well, you must remember it's moving. It's a larger machine, so it's moving larger distances. Uh, but the, and of course, the SS is a fast machine. But actually, when it comes to machining, because it's doing product we couldn't do on the other machine, it's a no-brainer. It has to be done on this one. So yeah, it's a, it is a fast machine. And you can now, with this, go into full five-axis simultaneous machining if you chose to. I know a lot of your work is three plus two, but you could go that to that extra level if you wanted to. Absolutely, that option is available to us with this machine. Yeah. And is that something that you've considered as a company? Do you think you may go down that road? Well, to be honest with you, at the present time, we haven't got a large requirement for it. And we're not having a lot of people banging on our doors saying, this is where we want to go. But it's there. So if someone comes to us and says, this is how we'd like a job mate, then we, we can push that button and we can have that available. And, and you're operating in a demanding, demanding market. I mean, for engineering companies, Apex Precision ne needs to, you need to satisfy the needs of your customers. Therefore, you need reliability and responsiveness from your suppliers. Does this Haas machine and do Haas automation give you both of those? Oh, for sure. It's very useful for us. Haas is just up the A11, but wherever you are, they always give a good service. When you phone them, they keep you in contact, you know what's happening, and the guys come to it and give you a good service. And often with a new machine into the market, a new model, there's, there's teething problems, but I've never really heard many of those happening with this UMC. W would, you, would you agree with that, that they've come and they've hit the market and they've hit the ground running and um, you know, they've, they've kind of set in UK manufacturing alight with the five axis solution? Yeah, the, the package came in, the installation came in and it all went very smoothly. And since then we've been machining and making parts, which is exactly what we want to do. 
and your business here, you're in Cambridge here in, in, in Haverhill. Are you busy at the moment? If, if buyers were watching this video, what would you be offering them as a, as a solution provider? Well, as a solution provider, we have a range of machines offering different bits and offering different capabilities. But this particular machine just gives us an edge out from where we've been before. We can still make all the parts we've made previously on this machine, but we can do a lot more as well. So it en enhances our capabilities, which is where we want to be. Good stuff. A successful machine in business. Thank you very much for your time, David. Thank you.